Father. Two. What are you doing? This is supposed to be a college. Oh, I know this smart as you, Papa. Oh. College. Oh. <laughs> I, I am dumb. Yo, so guys, Prince Charming. We're gonna be checking out the part two to Bowser Jr.'s first grade part one. <laughs> so this is the last half to the part one of the multi-part series of first grade. So yeah, previously on the first grade series, Junior just got to class, first day of school. This is after summer school, so he passed summer school. He's in first grade. All of his friends are in his class. He even met a little a little boo thing right in front of him. I think her name was like Wendy, or I think that's why I called her, because she had red hair. She looked like Wendy, the fast food girl. <laughs> and then the teacher uh, soiled his pants, and then he started spazzing out. So Junior had to call the school nurse. And then the school nurse has to tell the principal because they need a new teacher. So the principal is coming back, and we all know the principal in junior kind of has some some beef from the uh, from the whole summer school series. But don't forget to hit me up on my Twitter at Prince Hawkum, my Instagram as well at Prince Hawkum, and subscribe to the second channel if you want more content, more behind the scenes, just some more Prince Charming. Make sure you go subscribe. Link in the description below. Enough of me talking. Let's go and check out that small movie, Bowser Junior's First Grade Part One. And this is the second half to it, so this is part one, part two. It's so confusing, but <laughs> uh, let's get into this video. Oh my god, he soiled himself! Sure, dude! Yeah, he, he All right, kids! All right! All right, kids! Calm down! Calm down! I need to get emotional! Don't be emotional! I'm just gonna drag him to the nurse's <laughs> station, okay? Okay, go, go, go! All right, come on! Oh. What are we gonna do about a teacher? You gonna drag him? I will call the principal's <laughs> office! I don't think you're supposed to, supposed to drag people. Oh, and here comes the principal. I'm back. Here he comes. So oh, wow. <laughs> I like how the music starts when he opens the door. Hello, failures. <laughs> oh, dear God. You ready? You ready? You ready, oh, Junior? Oh, you gotta, you gotta meet old foes. Old enemies. <laughs> why is he treating his students like this? Like, why are you a principal? If you... Nothing. Welcome to the first grade! Oh gosh. Oh, oh, sir, you're really scary. This man's an evil villain. <laughs> oh, thanks. I get that a lot. But anyway, your teacher broke uh, his hip. Shame on him. Now I have to get a replacement for you. Shame on him? He's old. Uh, is, the, is the replacement teacher you? <gasps> no! I would never teach brats. <laughs> your teacher's coming right now. All right, you oh, got a replacement. Oh, okay, it's Jackie Chan. I am your Sosa Sutiso. Oh, and it looks like you're not the familiar faces. Jackie Chu. You got a promotion. <laughs> oh boy, my favorite teacher. Yeah, of course. He's my favorite Chu. He's not going to be boring like the stupid old man. Jackie Chu's awesome. Yeah. Oh, he so gave me a lot of work, so though. Oh, thank you, Mr. Chu, for coming to Give teach these calculus. Teams. Something. Oh, that's a Ruri. Some of them are familiar faces. Oh, I know yeah. them from summer school. That's good, that's good. Familiar no, faces. No, she's just a substitute. And we have a permanent teacher coming soon, so you're okay. gonna be here forever. Okay, that's you dope. Fine with me. <sighs> okay. Okay, I can get behind it because, like he said, he's just a substitute teacher. And honestly, I'd rather have Jack the Chew than the old man. The old man was was terrible. The old man did not want you using technology. He didn't understand anything. He was kind of racist. He actually was racist. <laughs> this man did not like any minorities at all. So I guess it's good that we got Jackie Chew back. He really is an upgrade. It's just he'd just be assigning calculus to elementary school students. I wouldn't be down with that. That's the one part I don't like about Jackie Chew because Lord knows I would not be able to do calculus at that young age. <laughs> I won't be able to do calculus now. It's been so long. <laughs> This is that. supposed to be in a college. Oh, I'm not as smart as you, Papa. Oh. College? Oh. You're dumb. <laughs> I, I am dumb. Repeat after me. You are dumb. I am dumb. Oh my I goodness. Shit. That's, that's not oh, okay. <laughs> you 2,000 calculus problems with you. Oh. Oh. You don't deserve to wear the crown anymore. 2,000? To Jackie Chu, <gasps> Fortune 500. He brought dishonor? Oh, you're so stupid. And why are you doing your assignment? Uh, my teacher broke his hip. Oh, <laughs> you think just because he broke hip? You, you, you can't do assignment. Oh my gosh. Oh, why would you want, why would you want your, <laughs> your father as your teacher? <laughs> you, oh, you so did. You so did. Your, your sister did better than you. Oh. For that, yes. you gotta make me two iPad. 
Two iPads. Two iPads? Okay. Oh, you dumb. Make you me dumb. an iPad. Make three. <laughs> All right, Crash. Now that you see how dumb my son is. Oh my gosh. Because of what happened today, I'm going to let you guys go home early. Ooh. But before I do, I'm going to teach you something. One second. All right, I'm going to read. Oh my Green goodness! Edge and Three days in here, really? <laughs> never happen, kids. Green eggs and ham mean very bad, very bad for you. Yeah, don't eat green, uh, egg, green eggs green and ham. Green eggs and ham by Dr. Seuss. Yeah, he not a real doctor. All right, that's is he Sam really I not am. a real doctor? That's Sam I am. I thought he was a doctor of uh, like philosophy. That's Sam I am. Do you like green eggs and ham? No, I don't. Where you go? Yeah. You do not like Ugh. green eggs and ham. It's stupid book. <laughs> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Done reading for today. He didn't even finish I'm going it. To give you all homework. He didn't even finish the book. For your new teacher. <laughs> Wait, what? A homework on your first day? Yes. Oh God, yes. What? No, Cody no, loves homework. Bad. I love homework. No, it's uh. bad. I don't want homework on the first day of school. That sucks. I have plans. Oh, I want to play sports. Yeah. 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 Traumatized by the death of the old man. Yeah. You yeah. really try to take my phone. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I don't want homework. <laughs> all right, Who wants guys, homework? You <laughs> homework. It's to write 1001 essay on why Dr. Sue, no real doctor. What? Okay, turn it in tomorrow for credit. No, a thousand page essay. That's crazy. I can agree with the little kid. That is pretty crazy. A thousand word essay on explaining why Dr. Seuss isn't a real doctor. What? I'm sure he's not a medical doctor. Like, there ain't no way a medical doctor is out here writing children books. Maybe there is a medical doctor who's writing children books. But if you go to med school... <laughs> You're probably gonna be operating on people, not reading, writing literature for snot-nosed little kids. Like you're gonna put your medical, medical degree to work. Like, come on. I remember back in elementary school, we actually did serve green eggs and ham for lunch, like one day. And don't get me wrong, it was probably just food coloring, but still, it was food coloring eggs and food coloring nasty ham. But given that we were kids, we thought it would be the most delicious thing in the world. So, of course, everybody ordered it. <laughs> but when it came down to actually eating it, people got on lunch line and saw, like, it looked nasty. So, nobody wanted it. So, we all got, like, the alternative was, like, chicken sandwich, which meant everybody who got chicken sandwich ran out. So, there were people who were stuck with green eggs and ham for the day. And I was not one of those people. I was not going to eat green eggs and ham. But I sure as hell raised my hand for green eggs and ham when they're calling who wants green eggs and ham. <laughs> but wait, baby, isn't this crazy? Oh, yeah, it's so crazy. Oh, so my gosh. Of crazy thing. Cookies for breakfast. <laughs> no, I'm going to kill myself. No, oh. you kill yourself, Patrick. You always say you're going to kill yourself. Shut up, Emily. You're just mad because mom loves you more. Yeah, that's your yeah. sister. <laughs> I knew it. Uh, Mr. Jackie Chu, what if I don't do the essay? Oh, so you're wondering if you could just skip essay. You yeah, fail. I'll tell you, if you don't do essay, you fail. You don't turn in, you gonna fail. You fail. Oh, first grade, oh. and then you gonna have to see me. See so him. School again. You have to fight but him. You're, but you're not our teacher for the rest of the year. So how can you fail? He's just a substitute. Yeah. I put in good word for you and say, oh, he gonna fail. He gonna fail. How's that a good word? You <laughs> talk. Ah, okay, I'll do the essay. I just uh. don't want to do. It. I thought you should be a fun teacher. Yeah, you asked for a fun teacher oh, and got taxed, Jackie Chu. You don't get lunch today. You just go home. Go home. Yeah, yeah, go home early. Okay. All right. I'll take that. <laughs> You're a new teacher tomorrow. <sighs> Thank God this day's over with. Yeah, I know. Uh, the first sucks, day of right? school. We didn't even get to learn anything today. Uh. But Cody, shut up. We don't have to learn all the time. And we're only in first grade. We have 11 more years to learn. Right? Yeah. You have plenty of more years to learn I'll stuff. I'll Emily's number before we leave. Ooh. Okay. Uh, uh, Hey, Emily. Okay, Junior. Um, I know this is a silly question, okay. but uh, can I get your number? <laughs> I don't have a cell phone. I'm in first grade. Of course. Well, that's stupid. I mean, I have a cell phone. I'm in the first grade. Okay. My friend Joseph, uh, he Facts. has a cell phone, and he's Facts. in the first grade. Facts. Facts. Cody has a cell phone, and he's in the Facts. first grade. Facts. You're just behind. Your parents are poor. She just don't want to give it to it's you. It's to this generation. Oh. Well, you're dumb, and you're stupid. Oh. Can I get your Facebook information? Oh, well, okay. No, I'm in first grade. <laughs> well, uh, can I come over to your house? Oh. No, stay away from me. Come on, Patrick. <laughs> okay, man. Junior, you are just striking out. Like, three strikes, you're out, bro. Stop trying, because now you look just really desperate. At first, I thought she was saying uh, she really, like, she said no, she doesn't have a phone because she's in the first grade. 
But she probably does have a phone, and she just doesn't want to give you her number. I have heard the most ridiculous excuses on why women don't want to give a guy a number. And it's, it's normal. It should be okay. A girl should be able to tell a guy no, but guys can't take no, so they have to come up with excuses or lies to, you know, not hurt our ego in the, in the uh, process of telling us why they can't give us our number or their number. I've actually had a girl say, one, that she didn't know her number. <laughs> Two, she left her phone at home and like her number's on her phone. And like I said, she doesn't know her phone number. Three, that she's not allowed to add people that she doesn't know because it's her business, phone work, whatever. It was plenty of excuse, excuses. Take that as a girl trying to tell you to go away. Don't dig into it. Don't hit her with a counter. Don't try to still get at her. Just take the L and move on. Oh, she digs me. She only digs me. Oh my gosh, she's here. Have a girlfriend. You are delusional. <laughs> Where is that girl with my Capri Sun? Oh, D money. Uh, I oh can't gosh. find none. Capri Sun, okay? Uh, 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 you uh, messed uh, up, then. You know what I have to do now. What you gotta do? Oh, see, you don't slap the shit out of me. D money. That's that's. What's that supposed to do? It's not a way to treat a girl. Uh, D money. Skull. Never do that to women. Baby. Why? Well, yeah, our teacher pooped his pants and broke his hip. Yeah. And then I had to go get the nurse, and then the principal came in and yelled at everybody. Mm. And then Jackie Chu came in and gave us homework. Homework. On the first day. The horror. Yeah, sounds like an average day at school. <laughs> yeah, I just, I just hope school gets better. Can you take me to Chuck E. Cheese to make me feel better? Oh. No, I'm not taking you to Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> of course he's not. Well, well, you didn't even eat your Play-Doh pizza. It's and still there. <laughs> oh. Did you? Um, I got hungry. Did you eat oh. it, Chef Pee Pee? Oh my gosh. He, I think I need to go to the hospital. He ate Play-Doh oh, pizza. Oh, What's wrong with you? Oh god, I'm gonna take a bite. No! No! Oh my gosh, you oh, ate Play-Doh pizza? <laughs> That was it for this video, guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. Wow, that actually ended way quicker than I thought it would. Like, that ended up... <laughs> I mean, if I had four minutes left, but hey, I guess the video is over. That was part two, or the finale to the Summer School series, and we're going to be watching part two on the next time I watch SML, so let's go ahead and see the new teacher that they get, because I don't think Jackie Chu is going to be the permanent teacher. First day of school, and Junior already has homework? I got I, I got side with him. That's, that's dumb. I would be highly upset if I got homework on the first day of school, especially when it's first grade and it's a thousand word essay on why Dr. Seuss isn't a real doctor. Do you even take that assignment seriously? Because Jackie Chu is a substitute teacher. Substitute teachers get no respect. It's not like your permanent teacher gave you that assignment. So to be honest with you, I probably wouldn't even do it. But don't forget to hit me up on my Twitter at Prince Hawkum, Instagram as well at Prince Hawkum. Subscribe to the second channel, link in the description below. We have tons of fun, more reactions, behind the scenes so make sure you go check out Prince Blast and hit me with a subscribe. But enough for me talking, my name is Prince Hawkum. Stay charmed my friends.